Hello, this is Jack with the Geek's Perspective. And, um, yeah, my place, my, uh, uh, this remnant that rides me ashes. Um, I make an excuse about the place being king, but I got a kitty cat sleeping in my lap, so I'm probably going to die a few times trying to prevent him from waking up because he's adorable. Um, so, good news is. I was able to get all my upgrading done before this, and we're going to go right in to try and take out that tunnel. Let's take a look. Hope everybody's doing well. It's uh, Sunday for me, so uh, this video should be coming out Monday, because I've been kind of recording the day before of, which um, some I really don't like. I don't like doing. Um, so I am sorry about that. I also hope the controls behave a little better this time, because like that right click thing that was going on is really upsetting. Yeah, oh, he's so adorable. I'd love to be able to let him rest on my arm, but I can't reach the keyboard otherwise. When I play a PlayStation or I have a controller, it's much easier. Sorry, I'm trying to hold back a burp. Alright. Uh, that's interesting. Weird, like misty darkness up ahead. Okay, we get some storyline stuff. Oh, he looks friendly. Um, he looks like he needs a bullet, maybe two. Oh, hi, shroud. I did it dumb and got focused on one target. Sword doesn't. Yes, sword doesn't hit as hard as smuggler uh, as my other weapons, especially not compared to the pistol. We can pretty much one shot these things. But as I said before, it does seem to hit faster. Whoa! I don't know what just hit. That was probably the, uh, the crowd, who is a regenerator parent. Okay, I don't like that he can do that. Uh, so I got my little circle of healing back up. Where is he? Where is he? Oh, he is way over there. And he seems to spawn jerks from after me. Now, I'm curious if he's designed to do that more to make it a challenge for me. Oh, it's been everything has to load. Or that's the coming. Oh, it did. I got lucky. Okay, I need to remember I have a dodge button. Anyway, if they're there to make the uh, fight more challenging or uh, to give me an avenue of getting bullets. Or both. Yeah, it seems like I got lucky with that and I stepped out of the way in time. So keep moving is the key to this. Uh, the downside is that doesn't allow me for much control of access. Uh, oh, uh, I'm bleeding? Okay, oh, shit. There we go. Uh, thankfully I did have a... Well, I'm just getting these little guys. Little being a relative term, grossly in reference to how durable they are. So, uh, thought I had. There it is. Got it at that time. Yeah, he's gonna get me just because I don't have any more ways to heal myself. Killed all the ammo for that gun. And they got me. Oh boy! Yeah. So, yeah, this is definitely a boss fight. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and jump back to um, Ward 13 real fast. 
uh, just to pick up some supplies, because I'm feeling, one, I'm going to need bandages, that's for sure. Um, but two, uh, probably some of those healing potions would be a good idea, because the DOT healing, um, or HOT, hot, uh, healing over time, would probably be very helpful. And after this, I need to stop upgrading my weapon so much, I focus on upgrading my armor, so that's what I'm going to do. Hey, Traveler. What you got for me? Let's trade. Uh, oh, she just sells iron. That's Later. Great. Which in theory I can go by just like so upgrade my Hello again, friend. Uh, armor. But I'm going to the stick best. with getting some uh, potions because they cost money. Um, shoot, he's got blood work but no actual healing potions. What does adrenaline even do actually? Um, increased movement speed, standing aim, and melee speed. Oh, okay, that's actually not bad. Uh, I'm going to get that. I didn't get it before. Since he's got trinkets, Ring of the Admiral. Uh, damage received is increased, but okay. So it, it's kind of a gamble. Either you, if you're someone who's good at dodging and all that good stuff, then that would be a very good thing to have. Um, what's Frenzy Dust? Increased fire rate, reload speed by for all heroes. So if I'm playing with friends, that helps. Um, so really, the bandages are pretty much the last thing I kind of want. So let's get five, because I'm tired of running out of those things. Um, See, but unfortunately I, didn't get, I wasn't able to get any of the uh, healing potions. Um, which is okay, I still have the Q ability, um, and I have that constantly regenerating, um, uh, whatever you call it. Now, by the way, I found out that your special abilities like that constantly do regenerate. Um, by the way, if you hear any noises behind me, it's the dishwasher going away. I am sorry about that. Um... He's having a dream, he's so adorable. He's like kicking his leg over here. Um, I forgot what I was going to say. Um, hopefully I'll just remember that I can dodge and I don't have any uh, aiming issues or forgetting to reload issues. Because that, that came up a couple times. So let's see here. Um, and hopefully I don't have to get him all the way dead. Like, hopefully like after I break his first health bar he leaves. Because he, like, he regenerates. And that makes him horrible. better off. He's a little less tedious than I thought. Uh, I was able to unload on him that time. By the time I just find him again, he'll be at full health again. I'm pretty sure he's behind me somewhere. Nope. I wonder if he can hit me if I'm standing underneath something. It just occurred to me that might be a thing. So if I throw down the circle, having a roof over my head like where I'm at right now, would be very beneficial. So he can only appear in front of me. And let me shoot on him. I'm bleeding. I did a double. I almost got one of his bars of health down, and I'm hoping that he can't regenerate past it. He's over there spawning. Alright, so I got him past one of his little health bars. And it looks like he can regenerate past it. Unless you broke see it stop. He looks like he's gonna keep going. I'm in trouble. Oh. Okay, I got lucky with that. I didn't realize the circle was gone. <sighs> he is kicking my butt. Uh, let's see here. 
I didn't have to use any bandages. Oh yeah, and I forgot I was bleeding that whole time too, so that wasn't helping. Yeah, so that makes a difference. But I've kind of figured out, like I have an idea of what to do now. I need to be mindful of the other guys, but I need to focus on him with his regenerating. I just gotta put damage into him. I might actually have to switch back to my other gun and put more damage. Cause that seemed to have the ability to like, cause he is an archer. It seemed to have the ability to, uh, because of the nature of how it shot, to stop him from shooting with arrows. Does this thing actually teleport too far away? Either? Oh, I got out of that one. Just fine. Alright, I'm gonna move and take care of some of these guys. That keeps annoying me with the switching the camera. But that's okay. Alright, cool. Oh, he doesn't like melee. It's not doing extra damage or anything, it's just that uh, he doesn't know how to respond to it. I didn't start healing fast enough. My mouse is changing color to red. I just noticed that. That's really cool. My mouse changed red when I died. Like, that should be something I'm happy about. That's awesome. And he's still asleep. He's still adorable. I'm sorry, I'm going to keep fawning over Zane because he's my little buddy. I don't know if you like cats or not, but... Zane is my little buddy. He's He's been there for me on some of my darker days. Um, in case those who don't know me, I have bipolarism. And I go through depression spells. And um, he's just always been there. Like, when I can go back. He's technically a support animal, emotional support animal. And he has been uh, a boom the whole time. By simply going to a spot he can't aim. Because he doesn't walk, he tells us. Alright, run a little bit. Take advantage of the fact he doesn't know melee. Force him to move. Doesn't like getting shot either, apparently. But who does? Shooting me face up, no bad. No shoot. I hate that artillery shot, I really. Do. Where is he? Oh, for those who don't know that reference, by the way, Shooting McFace is a uh, character in uh, Borderlands 2, I want to say. Yeah, 2. Um, he, he's an easy quest where he asks you to shoot him in the face. I thought I banished myself up, but I guess he got me again with it. But apparently my health is enough or somebody hit me. Oh, hi. Thank you for spawning next to me so I can do this. Oh, he can actually, so he can shoot in the face. And he can also do that apparently. He can do an artillery shot. Oh, good. Shoot, I should have healed. I still had like two of the dragon hearts. And I was so close. Man, work is blowing me up right now. Because I can, he I have Facebook on on a web page behind the game, and I can just hear them dinging me. And plus, you might be able to hear my phone going off. I need to really put that on Do Not Disturb. Oh, my legs start to hurt. And I can't adjust it without waking him up. See if I can get him this time. I'm gonna open with the pistol because that's my heaviest damage. And he missed. And I missed because he dodged. I forgot that he teleports when he first appears. I'm gonna make him appear where I can see him. Okay. I'm gonna try.
try and control where he is. Okay, well, he's teleporting right now. Alright, you can actually outwalk that shot. Try and move away, force him to appear where I want him to. Yep. I got stuck in a narrow pathway. That was my mistake. I'm gonna have to move my leg as much as I don't want to wake Zane. There we go. Zane's a little bit heavy sleeper at times. Oh, I feel so better. Like, uh, my uh, thigh was really starting to hurt. So I'm gonna tell you a weird pathological fear I have. I, I'm, like, I'm afraid, like, something will happen, like, uh, I'll develop an allergy or something to cats, and it'll just be torture to have him around. Like, there's something weird that occurred to me as I was going to sleep, I'm like, could you imagine that? Like, like, you have a cat or a dog that you just absolutely love, and then you just suddenly become allergic to it? Uh, he doesn't look like he moves far. I thought he reloaded. There we go. I can resort to the pistol for when uh, somebody absolutely needs to die. Scrap. Back down. Oh, that was. That all you got? Actually, please don't ask if that's all you got. Serpentine. He actually does have trouble, seem to have trouble hitting me on Serpentine. Unless I Serpentine right into a shot, but that's, that's neither here nor there. So I got a roof over my head now. So his, his artillery shot might have trouble hitting me. And I'm healing. Of course, it doesn't help if you run out of the. He doesn't start from my base when you bleed. So I'm wondering if as you knock his health down, he actually gains ability. Like, it's a common trope among bosses. Oof. While I'm bleeding, it looks like I actually heal less, too, because that didn't take me back up to full. Right, my Serpent Titan's not working anymore. Alright, he's gonna work over here in a second. I knew it was coming. Still got me. But that's okay. I was able to hit him with a good shot before he uh, he forced me to move. All right. Oh, I found him. I got him. How oh shoot, I've got like two shots left on that gun. Yeah, I think when you're bleeding you actually feel less too. I'm worried about him now more than the little ones. There you go. Damn it. Headshot. Oh, and I killed him. Now, let me do this. Woo! It's over. Okay, everybody else seemed to disappear when they died. Okay. Oh, I can breathe now. That's good. I didn't realize I was holding my breath. No, that 
was that was an intense fight. I didn't honestly when I first started, I did not think I was gonna be able to beat him. Um, now I gotta figure out how to get back up because I've been running down here the whole time. Um, oh, maybe I don't need to. Yeah, it looks like it's actually ground level. I need to go, so let's see. Because I can see on the mini map where I gotta go. Oh yeah, I know how I gotta get back up. I'm an idiot. Put a big D, uh, D for dunce on my forehead right now. My friend, the staircase was right here. I ran right past it, too. I need to pay attention right now, because I just won, and I really don't want to have to fight him again. So I don't want something like a, uh, like a trap or something to kill me. Now, I am kind of curious if I could have actually bypassed him if I had just run this way. Um... I'd rather not know, because then I might take advantage of that later. Um, I'm proud that I won. Ugh, I need light. Alright. Oh, and good, I am hitting a checkpoint right up here. Oh, that's no, not even a checkpoint, just an exit. Alright. So. Oh, he is so adorable. Passed out this way. Just sprawled out across my lap. Um, and in case you don't know, in reference to what I said earlier, that wasn't even the quest I was looking for. I thought it was. It was just a dungeon. Alright, whatever. I'm gonna go to the checkpoint over here. One, it's gonna restore all my ammo, which I actually stocked up a lot once I was able to go back and loot all the uh, jerks I've been killing. Oh, what's this? Oh, no, I did uh, show up where I wanted to. And this opens up the background. Okay, so it it was a uh, it wasn't the subway like I thought, but it was where I needed to go. So I just turned on this checkpoint, and I just opened up that shortcut that I had um, looked at before and couldn't get through. So well, I got to guess that's a radio going. Come here, Stu. I'm gonna love eating you. I pray you love So it's saying I can make a new weapon mod from her. Let's go check that out. Because I got this weird... Oh, he woke up. No, he's going back to sleep. Because I got that weird driftwood thing. I'll have to see what that's like. Um, I do need to start making this these videos shorter, the uh, remnant ones, because they've been going about 30 minutes, which I got no problem doing that, honestly. It's more of... Um, I, I want to keep to the rule of two episodes a day coming out. Um, keep and, moving. And if I what? keep playing like this, where I have like instead of it being a shorter one, it's three minutes. All right then. Rattleweed shoots projectile that spawns a rattleweed upon impact uh, with 20, 240 health and draws aggro to all enemies. Oh, it's a distraction. I definitely want to make that. Yeah, it's a shade wood it gave me and all the luminate crystals. So let's go ahead and do that. I can buy items. So I can buy the ones I previously could have had, like Hotshot, um, which is interesting. We're um, done here. I might make my pistol the healing weapon, and then make the uh, rapid fire. Oh, traveler. Um, Certainly. Um, and as I said before, I'm going to upgrade armor more than anything else. Uh, I cannot. I do not have enough iron. Okay, so that's not an issue. So long. So I actually didn't do that much. I just kind of ran down there and fought a boss, but uh, which is quite a bit, but not that much. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share. Especially if you find Zane adorable, who's passed out right now. <laughs>